Teletape for this one, Noksukao Tommy Zeus, 23 years old, Shotokan practitioner, he's going to be the shorter fighter by a full five inches here, but unfazed by the shenanigans of that man, Shazahib Rind, 24 years old, as you saw originally fighting in a Sander style, he's representing Pakistan, and you heard his coach Asim in the VT a few moments ago mention the sheer amount of support that he has uh, back home watching this fight. Your referee for this one is going to be Wayne Spinola. And notable mention is Shazaib at the last Fighters time he was in the middle time. of Ramadan. So he was fasting time and he said enter. it made him a little weaker. And he already had a great performance and now he's completely fresh with the food that his body needs. Yeah, stay that's going to be stay interesting. Back, stay back. Ready? Now, gentlemen. Karate Ready, Combat sir? 39 Ready, is powered by Hedera. No touch of gloves as expected. Rind in the black pants takes the center of the pit here. Azuz working the outside. It's a big left hand from the Frenchman to open up. Nice blitz. Yeah, trying to work the body. Rind looking for the knees. No yeah, knees can't clinch. No knees in the clinch. No, no. You can't clinch the knee. Ready? Fight. What the referee is explaining to Rind is you cannot be holding at the point of contact. You can pull the fighter onto the knee, but you have to have released your grip at the moment of contact. He said he was going to set up his high kick with middle kicks first. Oh, lovely sweep from Azuz. Swept straight back, though, by Rin. That was lovely work. Yeah, they, they fought into what we call a 50 50. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice sweep. I mean, both men with the, you know, it was lovely work. Oh, Rin lands. Great strike there by Azuz. Azuz uh, scored uh, two good punches so far. to slip underneath. Yeah, tried the big right hand there, just falling short. Oh, and he oh, rocks the base, and he, and he oh, drops it. Wow. Connected he the dropped it. Big ground and pound from Azuz. Well, they're going to get brought back to the feet here, but yeah. reality is firmly setting in for Jalahin Rim that he is in a scrap in this one. Oh, he's, he's, he's got, he's has a lot of success with that break, overhand, break, 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 overhand break, right break. and his left hook. Yeah, he connected with it like 30 seconds before as well. We were calling oh, again, again the again. left lands into the tie-up. Azuz trying to fight those inside break, break, ties break, so we can work the body. Azuz is doing a great yeah, job, you know, he's fighting at the perfect distance so far. He's got to get his head up here. With that big left hand on the way in. Super fast. And he throws that big left as he switches stances. Oh, lovely jumping knee from Rin. That landed very cleanly. It's Rind with the uh, forward pressure here now. He's taking the center of the pin. Anxious moments. Kick almost uh, connect. Oh, and Azuz has got to be careful. He's put, falling well short with those left hands the last two attempts. Now, now his opponent knows what he's trying to accomplish. Yeah, but it was nice also he threw the liver kick underneath That's the cross. Good. Work out, work out. No knees in the clinch. Stop, stop. No knees in the clinch. That's Let's the second warning for Rin about how he's landing those knees. We're going to see out the first round here. And guys, Tommy Azuz bringing the fire. And he's doing great. Wow, and he, he, he is the underdog. And he's, uh, wow. He's showing that everybody that, that like, everything is possible. <laughs> Super Amazing. fast, yeah, but the way he blitzed in with those crosses, very nice, landed them. <laughs> Let's take a look at some of the replays here, and we're going to see that left hand. That was a right on that occasion. Oh, God, do it. Oof. And, and what I like about Azus is the fact that he doesn't stop. He knows he's at the perfect distance when he's close to his opponent, and he knows that's where he needs to unleash. He, he, can't, he can't do the same thing if he's in mid-range because his opponent has a better, better reach at him. But when he's closed, that's a perfect time to unleash. He sloped the odds in, uh, in, into his favor. Well, a lot of the local support for Rind here. Tommy Azuz making his way across the pond from Ready? Paris for this bout. 
underway in our second round here. Oh, oh a knee. A nice side kick. Oh, the kick just missed again. Yeah, and this Partial, is good. Partially hit, maybe. There. This is great volume from Rind. A fantastic start to the second round for him. Nice turn around there by Jesus. Kicks now backing Azuz up, starting to put him against the pit wall, and it's all one-way traffic here in the opening second. It's looking like the Pakistani has made all the adjustments he needed in his corner. Yeah, the momentum have shifted. Oof. Back up, back up. Fight! Yeah, he's, he's, he's falling short now. He's, he's not at the right distance to blitz now. Yep, he, he needs to his find his distance back. Rind has been uh, training, living, and, and in fact sleeping at the goat shed gym. Just across the other side of Miami here. Oh, he's one, got one. a with the left hand. He needs to have it higher, right? Yes. And the, the, the overhand just missed, and the kick missed as well. So they were both in, in a vulnerable position. Stop, 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 right in the back of the head. Watch the back of the head. Don't hit the back of the head. Fight. We saw in the Varga fight how tough Tommy Azuz was. He'll hang in there even when he starts tiring and the gas tank starts going. But he's got to find a way back into this one because he's taken two stop. minutes break of clean. nothing but offense stop, clean. from Shazahi Brind. Stop. you got to stop. Fight. And you see Azuz is trying to break and find a little bit of distance. He doesn't want to slow down in that clinch. Oh. Azuz barreling stop. forward. Quickly, stop back. 20 seconds. Fight. Very tough fight because they put a lot of volume. Both guys put a lot of volume of punches and kicks. Spend a lot of energy in that fight, so it might come comes down to who has the best conditioning. Yeah. Hands up free. Oh, oh, beautiful. Huge Haragoshi off that overhook grip. What a fantastic exclamation point on what was a very comprehensive round overall for Shazahim Rin. Might be 1-1. One, one. Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. The, 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 the tie has turned. Uh, the crowd trying to keep their fighter motivated here. We see Tommy Azuz in his corner. They need to touch the floor. The bottom need to touch the floor. Let's take a look at some of the replays, guys. Talk us through the action. That knee, that was a really nice knee that he threw when he got in there. It doesn't look like it, but I'm telling you, that might have done something to the body. He looks down, so it's probably a high kick, right? Yeah, yeah. really well camouflaged. Oh. <laughs> Wow, everything is with power. But Azus, you know, if he can't connect and land that right again, boom, Ooh. like this one, he's got to watch out. Rind has to watch out for that. Well, probably all to play for going into this third and final round as they re-enter the pit. Oh, look at that, psychic to the face. Rin started, yeah, Rin started the second round very fast and never really took his foot off the gas. Let's see if Azuz can reclaim some of the tempo here. Yeah, he needs, needs to go back to what he did at the beginning. He's spawning a little bit short now. Yep. Oh, tried that outside trip again. That worked. That worked in the, in the first round, but now his opponent has adjusted himself. 
And as you say, with all his strikes, his distance management's just going a little bit awry. Oh, covering up here. Good he's, strike. Yeah, he's, he's got to start turning towards the face and put some defense together. He can't turn away like that. Beautiful knee again there by Rin. Half of this third and final round left, and Azuz backed up once more against the pit. Zeus has got about a minute left here to find some offense, and boy, does he need it at this point. And he, 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 oh, oh, that's yeah. what he needs. I was just going to say, he needs to land that cross. And, and Azuz has a good, a good Yokogiri, too, a good, a good lead leg side, side kick. Even if he's shorter, he should use it. Because now he only try for that, that overhand punch, and his opponent knows it's coming. He still connects sometimes, but he, he needs to, something different. Need to mix it up. Yeah, Rind is constantly pressing forward at this point. Yes, and he has more, more weapons. He can hurt you with his knees, with his kick, with his long jab, you know? Yeah, as we, you may have heard in the, the video trailer for this bout, you know, a combined Wushu and kickboxing record of 75 and 4. Uh, the number one ranked Wushu fighter in Pakistan. So a lot, a lot of experience in, in full contact environments. What I say there, throw so one body shot. Yeah. Do the solo punch. That's right, because they covered uh, the head. Yeah. Dwayne Ludwig did that. One shot, knocked him out to the body. <laughs> really pointing at the head, and then he gave him a body shot. Well, we see the third round now, and there is, uh, oh! oh. Some, some rough moments. Uh, yo, 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 yo. Uh, we're just going to get this under control, pit side. Some uh, extremely vocal support for Shazahib Rind here. And at some point, you know, you can play the games before the fight, but you've got to show respect to the fighter afterwards. That's right. This is karate. Tommy Azuz brought a fantastic fight here. Gave Shazi Brin to run for his money. He's probably going to drop the decision last, but respect and credit to the opponents. Yeah, the, the uh, troublemaker will be taking out of the facility and the show will, will go on. <laughs> yeah, we're going to get the uh, judges' scorecards collected here. Obviously, there's always a possibility of a sudden death fourth round, but guys, we think probably pretty comprehensively Shazi Breen took those last two rounds. I believe so, yeah. We are still awaiting a decision, though. I just got more tired from being in the audience, almost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, give us a few moments here to get these scores tabulated. A real, uh, you know, let's talk about Rin coming back with the momentum. He, he really did start putting his foot on the gas. He made the adjustments he needed and, and really took over in the second and third round. Yeah. That was just what George said, you know, he had more weapons. His punches and the kicks, he was tying everything together. Yeah, Azus did a great job in the beginning, but uh, he, he had only one thing, one weapon that works for him, this overhand and his... Let's go ahead, get the official decision. Karate combat fans, at the conclusion of three rounds, we have reached a unanimous decision. Your winner, out of the red corner, the pride of Pakistan, Shazam Thanks for watching, I'm Layla, and if you liked what you just saw, make sure you subscribe.